Hi, do you have Sublime Text and you use Python in Sublime Text and you want to use Sublime Wrapper? You know, um, Sublime Wrapper, once you installed it, um, you have to go here in uh, Tools, Sublime Wrapper, and Python, and Python run current file, and so you will have your program running like you can see here in my my program but what if you don't want to do all these things all the time that is very annoying if you have to try many times to um, if your program works uh, so you want to um, usually if you press ctrl b it should it should start right but if it doesn't you must you know here I, I press ctrl B and it worked but it worked um, because I do I did this I go, did, go to preferences and I do press this button keep binding and I I written this into my uh, sublime came up uh, file for the user so um, once you have this the programs uh, will run perfectly. I will mm, let you copy and paste this code into my into the info of this video. Mm, so for now I have to say that here you have the control B plus B uh, combination of buttons to run your program. You so you just have to uh, be sure that there is this combination here and then here in the CMD uh, key you will have this value here that in which you must uh, put your path to to your Python installation with your Python X that is different in each computer so what can you do to see where is your uh, your file if you don't if you don't know it you can go to the command line okay to the command line and write Python and once you start Python you can import the sys module and then you can write sys.path <coughs> so here it is you can see here where your file is and you can copy one of these maybe this and you see you don't want this zip file you go here and you copy and paste this one here and you just leave your uh, Python and then you have to write Python X here here is where your file is so every time you press B uh, you will have your wrapper running 